All right, what's up, everybody? We're going to check out Bill Burr adopting a dog right after this. Okay, first things first, of course, as I always do, I want to say welcome back if you're one of my subscribers. Love you guys, man. You're helping me build a really cool channel here, and I really appreciate that. We're going to check out Bill Burr adopting a dog. And I'm trying to get better about it. So far, every time I've seen a title come up and I'm like, yeah, how good is this going to be? <laughs> I have vastly underestimated him every time. <laughs> so <clears throat> anyhow, we're rolling a Bill Burr marathon here. Uh, suggestions are coming in off the other videos. Bill Burr adopting a dog. We're going to go ahead and kick off right now. And here we go. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus Christ, thank you very much. How are you? Thank you. Yes, thank you very much. I'm becoming a psycho. I've realized that about myself. I am. I watch conspiracy theory and like slap fights till like two in the morning on YouTube, you know? Yeah, I start like piecing shit together. I'm becoming that guy. I'm like that guy, you know, you sit there, you ever, you know, you're sitting there drinking in a bar and all, you know, some guy's cool, you're talking about the game, then all of a sudden he's just like, you know, there's no gold behind our, our currency. You realize that? You're like, oh yeah, that's great. Pick up your drink, let's fucking walk away. Yep. Oh, that's what I'm becoming. Totally into conspiracy. That's why I think Barack Obama is going to win their, uh, the, the, uh, the election. I think they're going to let him win because they're in the process, yeah, they're in the process of bankrupting this country and I think that they need a black guy to blame it on. Jesus. Yeah, that's what's going to happen. Dude, it'll totally feed into the rednecks. They'll be like, you see? You see what happened? Dude, he's only half black. Well, that's the half that did it. That's what happened. I bet the white half was saying. Uh, that's what they sound like, too. Is that too you know what I'm saying? I'm fucking losing people. I am. I just look at TV and nothing makes sense to me. I'm sick of them telling me shit is shocking that it's completely obvious. Crocodile Hunter dies. Who can you fucking? Yes. Yes, I can totally believe it. That's why I watched the show. I watched it every week because I knew eventually he was going to fucking die. And I, I, wanted, I wanted to see it. <laughs> right? Oh, man. Oh, I like that. Uh, yep, that dog, going to hell for laughing at that. Or the, uh, the phone message he left. You know, people are like, can you believe he left, a, he left that racist message? It's like, dude, look at him. <laughs> Look at him, some redneck with a mullet down to his ass, he drives a pickup, he's got the gloves with the fingers cut off, yeah, who would have thought he had a couple of fucked up ideas rolling around in his head, you know? Right? Dude, you know what would have been shocking? If he could play the cello, that would have been shocking, right? Yeah, then you'd be sitting there like, like, god damn, look at Doc! Here it is, I thought he was some racist God on his way damn. to a steak and shake, and he's busting out a little Beethoven. <laughs> God damn, I owe this guy an apology, you know? God, I'd love to see his iPod. I can't imagine the excitement <laughs> of music. <laughs> oh, man. There's so much time I spent alone on the road, man. I actually spent so much time on the, alone on the road, I actually, like, contemplated milk to the point I can't even fucking drink it anymore. I'm sitting there drinking, man, this stuff is great, tastes awesome, you know? Then I started thinking, it comes out of the carton, and I just did the police work, it, it comes out of a cow, and I'm like, I am fucking suckling for another species. <laughs> we have such a crazy relationship with cows. <laughs> you ever think about that? No, you, you can nurse from it, you can eat it, right? You can tip it over when it's sleeping, but if you fuck it, you're going to jail. <laughs> I am. No, what the point. Hell? Nothing alive is dependent on me. I, I got I to gotta get out of this. <laughs> it's a tailspin, man. So I'm thinking about getting a dog. My girlfriend wants me to, to like adopt a dog. She's like, you want to adopt a dog? We should rescue one. You, you want to do that? I'm like, no. No, I don't. She's like, why not? I go, because I think a lot of those dogs there, they're a little fucked in the head. <laughs> yeah. How do you think they ended up down there? It's like, dude, that's not a pet store. That's like doggy death row, all right? Why don't we just go to a prison and, like, adopt an inmate on the off chance that maybe they didn't commit the crime, you know, just roll the dice? Dude, fuck that. I want a brand new 2008 bulldog, all right? I don't want some, <laughs> I don't want some like, 1995, <laughs> half a Labrador. It's got part of its ear chewed off, you know? Every time I go to use the toaster, it starts freaking out. 
know, because his last owner hung him from the ceiling fan every time the Jets didn't cover the over, you know? Dude, that is an animal. That thing could kill you. If it, you know, if a squirrel wanted to fuck me up, if it just started running at me, by the time I processed, like, is that a rat? Is that mechanical? By the time I figured it out, it would have ran up my leg and just taken chunks out of my ear. But I gotta tell that story for the rest of my life, sitting in a bar. Like, yeah, dude, a fucking squirrel, right? <laughs> Never get laid again. Oh, man. That's what I'm saying, right? I Ooh. get one of those crazy dogs, get up at like 3 in the morning to take a leak. Right, I'm shuffling to the bathroom, and that's the exact moment his previous owner used to come home shit-faced and beat the crap out of the dog, right? I got no clue. I'm just, you know, sitting there shuffling to the bathroom. <laughs> Meanwhile, the dog's getting all amped up, like, fuck this shit, man. I promised myself I wouldn't let this happen again, all right? It's time to man up. Man up. Ah! Out. <laughs> Takes a big chunk out of my neck. Then what? I'm laying on the ground, bleeding. Ah. What are they gonna do with the dog? They're gonna take him right back down to the prison like some repeat offender, have like shackles on him and stuff. He's just sitting there hopping back in. We knew you'd be back. Yeah, go fuck yourself. Get me a new book, you know? <laughs> Wheel him in like Hannibal Lecter with like that lampshade around his neck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna work on my temper though. It's something I really gotta do. <laughs> Don't we all? <laughs> I, let, I, let, I, let, I let like the thoughts. Just spin away, you know? I was on a plane the other day. I actually had the urge to elbow an old lady in the face. It was like compelling. It was unbelievable. Oh my God, man. <laughs> you know when you go to get off a plane, there's like rules when you go to get off the plane, all right? It goes row by row by row. And this lady was all like, ooh, I'm 90. I get to cut everybody, right? So I'm competitive. I start Here fucking boxing go. her out, right? <laughs> start bringing down like the overhead luggage, you know? So she Ridiculous. just starts like waddling around me. And all of a sudden, I just feel my elbow like, dude, you're going to take this shit? <laughs> this is ridiculous, man. Oh, the whole no. half of the plane is watching. Oh, come on, no. Come on. Dude, we got a wide open shot. <laughs> just, just, just real light. Poof. You know, you got to hit it that hard. And then you can play it off. <laughs> I'm literally talking to my elbow like, dude, come on, man. We can't do this shit, all right? This chick's like 95 years oh, old. Oh, no. We can't do it. And I thought I had my body under control. And she got like to right about there. And then I felt my foot like, dude, we could still trip her. You still trip her. Just throwing that out there. All right, I'm out of time. You guys were awesome. Thank you so much. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> what I'm realizing here is that the more Bill Burr videos I watch, the more blatantly apparent it becomes that I'm going straight to hell. Like that's <laughs> that's the end. They're, they're like putting check marks behind my name somewhere in some list. Because <laughs> the stuff that I laugh at is just terrible. I'm learning a lot about myself here. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, I might have to start putting a tally up or something. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, we're, uh, we're, we're rolling through this Bill Burr marathon, man. So we're going to have a lot more coming out. Uh, we've already got a few. I'll start. I'll, I'll put a video. Uh, what should I do? I'll put a link to a playlist in the uh, description. That way you guys can watch all these these Bill Burr reactions because we're rolling them out one after another. These are great, man. This, this dude is on point. So be sure to click that subscribe button. Hit the notify bell. That way you don't miss out on any of those. Uh, if you're seeing this on Facebook or somewhere else, just like and follow it so you don't miss out on it there. And if you have suggestions, definitely leave those in the comments. A few of these videos have already come off of comment suggestions. So if you have ideas, leave them there. And it doesn't have to be Bill Burr. It can just be anything. Uh, anything that you think would be a great show. So other than that, thank you so much for watching. And I have more coming up.